morning, good afternoon or good evening, wherever in the world you might be watching. A warm welcome from down under. A client of mine contacted me to ask how he could change the order of columns in a very large spreadsheet that had some 40 columns and over 20,000 rows. I explained to him that there were five steps and we can use this sample spreadsheet to show you the procedure that he needed to follow. It meant that he didn't need to use cut and paste or try to drag columns around, which can be prone to problems in very large spreadsheets. Step one, your file can have as many or as few columns as you wish. However, if the file is in table format, then you need to convert it to a range by right clicking on a cell and going down to table and convert to range and confirm, confirm the conversion. Step two, insert a row above row one by clicking on the row number, right clicking and insert. Then number the columns in the order in which you want them. So we'll leave this one as number one and press enter. And we want the first name to be the third column. So we make that number three, click. The, the last name will be number two. The telephone extension will be the sixth column. The age will be number four and the salary will be number five. We've now ordered our rows in the order in which we want them to appear. Step three is an easy one. Click on any cell in the data and then press Control A. This selects all of the information in the file. Step four, click on the data tab and then choose the sort button and in the options tab, sort left to right and click OK. Then click the drop arrow next to sort by and choose row one and click OK. You'll now see that the columns have been sorted in the order in which you required them. Now click away to deselect. We can delete the row that has the numbers by right clicking on it and delete. And then if you wish to convert the data back to a table, click any cell and then insert table. And there we are when we click OK. We're back where we started with the data in the table, but now with the columns sorted into the order in which you want them. This is a very quick and easy method, but it is highly efficient and very easily done. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe unless you've already done so. And uh, remember to click the bell next to the subscribe button where you'll be automatically informed of upcoming videos. Again, thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.